Ethereum 2.0. Let's first take a quick overview of Ethereum 1.0. Ethereum 1.0 introduced the concept of decentralized applications and smart contracts, revolutionizing the blockchain industry. However, it faced challenges with scalability as the network became congested and transaction fees soared during peak usage times. Ethereum 2.0 is a major upgrade aimed at addressing these scalability issues. The primary goal of Ethereum 2.0 is to transition from the current proof-of-work, POO, consensus mechanism to a more energy-efficient and scalable proof-of-stake POS consensus mechanism. POS allows participants, called validators, to secure the network by locking up their Ether, ETH, as collateral, ensuring the network security and rewarding validators for their participation. The upgrade also introduces shard chains, which divide the Ethereum network into smaller chains, allowing parallel processing of transactions and smart contracts. These shard chains work in conjunction with the Beacon Chain, which coordinates network consensus and manages validators. The Beacon Chain stores and maintains the registry of validators and facilitates communication between the shards. Ethereum 2.0 brings several advantages and benefits to the network. First and foremost, it significantly improves scalability. With shard chains, Ethereum can process multiple transactions and smart contracts simultaneously, increasing the network's throughput. This enhancement opens up opportunities for mass adoption and paves the way for the development of resource-intensive applications. Another crucial advantage is energy efficiency. As Ethereum 2.0 moves from PAO to POS, it eliminates the need for mining, which requires substantial computational power and electricity. The POS mechanism reduces energy consumption while maintaining the network security, making Ethereum more sustainable and environmentally friendly. Security is also enhanced in Ethereum 2.0. With POS, attackers would need to acquire a significant amount of Ether to compromise the network, making it economically unfeasible. Additionally, the introduction of shard chains improves resilience against attacks, as each shard operates independently, limiting the impact of any potential breach. Developers will also benefit from Ethereum 2.0. The upgrade provides a more flexible and modular architecture, making it easier to build and deploy decentralized applications. The integration of EWSM, a new virtual machine, allows developers to use different programming languages, expanding the developer ecosystem and making Ethereum more accessible. Now let's discuss the phases of Ethereum 2.0. The upgrade is being rolled out in several stages. Phase 0 introduced the Beacon Chain, which went live in December 2020. The Beacon Chain marks the beginning of Ethereum's transition to POS and the coordination of the new network. Phase 1 focuses on implementing shard chains. These shard chains allow Ethereum to scale horizontally by processing transactions and smart contracts in parallel. Shard chains enhance the network's capacity, improving its scalability even further. Phase 1.5 is a crucial step in the Ethereum 2.0 roadmap. It involves merging the existing Ethereum 1.0 chain with Ethereum 2.0, ensuring a smooth transition for existing applications and users. This step minimizes disruption and maintains compatibility with the current Ethereum ecosystem. Finally, Phase 2 will fully implement shard chains and enable the execution of more complex applications on Ethereum 2.0. Although Phase 2 is still in development, it holds immense potential for the network's future growth and innovation. While Ethereum 2.0 brings promising advancements, it also presents challenges and concerns. The migration from Ethereum 1.0 to Ethereum 2.0 needs to be carefully managed to ensure a seamless transition without disrupting existing applications and users. Coordination and consensus among network participants are crucial to maintaining the integrity and security of the network during this migration process. Security considerations are also vital. Ethereum 2.0 must withstand potential attacks and vulnerabilities that could undermine the network security and user trust. Continuous research, testing, and community participation are essential to effectively mitigate these risks. Moreover, Ethereum 2.0's economic implications and impacts on stakeholders need to be thoroughly evaluated. Validators and users must understand the economic incentives and potential risks associated with participating in Ethereum 2.0 to make informed decisions. As for the current progress, the Beacon Chain has been successfully launched, and staking has begun. The Ethereum community is actively engaged in testing and development, with ongoing research to improve the network's security, performance, and usability. 
Ethereum 2.0 is an evolving project, and its roadmap includes specific milestones and timelines for the phased implementation. That wraps up today's video on Ethereum 2.0. If you found this information valuable, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more exciting blockchain content. Feel free to leave any questions or comments down below. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next video.